Hello, Pisces. You're getting ready to do your reading. Let's see what's going on for you. Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. All right. You have drawn to you love. Wow. Let me do one more. And afraid. Fear. Okay, so visitor. So someone may be afraid right now to approach you, or this could be you. They may have feelings for you. They may end up coming to visit you. Embrace change. We'll see. Okay. What is the overall energy for Pisces? Fear of rejection. So Knight of Coins, how you are feeling is lovers. How they are feeling is Four of Coins. Okay, yeah. So it kind of looks like they're holding back here. So they're drawn to you, but for whatever reason, Ace of Cups is under the deck. Uh, communication, wanting to communicate, wanting to see you, wanting, wanting to talk to you with the sun. Some A new cycle has been begun with this person, or just in general, I should say. Leo, possibly Gemini. Just probably, probably is not, but just throwing it out there. All right. What is this Knight of Coins energy? Eight of Cups, Nine of Cups. So walking away from something old and something new is coming in. A wish fulfilled. It could be an Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. You have the Lover's energy. So the Seven of Swords and the Wheel of Fortune. Let me do one more because I think you're holding back or maybe. Okay, a new cycle. One more, please. Okay, the King of Wands. Okay, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. This person could be missing you. So this could be their energy, of course. But I read this side as you. So this may be that you secretly like this person. You know they like you. Uh, you guys have been flirting, possibly. Maybe they've been checking you out as you walk by, or you've been checking them out or something. So it looks like this person is just afraid to approach, or if it's an ex or something, to reapproach. Or um, what is the Four of Coins? Why are they holding back? Judgment, Hermit. Yeah, so this person really is afraid. What's the next card? Okay, Ace of Wands. There we go. Good. Okay, Eight of Wands. Some communication is coming in. They could visit this with the Chariot. There's a Five of Cups. Okay. May come in very quickly. It's just suddenly, kind of like out of the blue. Might be a Cancer. Okay. He hasn't been thinking about this a lot. Maybe you know that this person has feelings for you with the Seven of Swords and you just kind of been waiting for them to make the first move. Why is this all happening or why is this person feeling so afraid or it oh, someone's feeling very overwhelmed. Okay, why? What is the Ten of Wands? Strength, Five of Wands, Two of Swords. Oh no, so <laughs> Lovers is under here. How did you fight with this person? Have you guys been fighting? Is it a Scorpio or a Leo? But um, this could be also moving work battles. Maybe they're going through a major divorce. I mean, obviously there's a huge issue here. So they are, for some of you, they're not avoiding you. They're just recouping. Maybe they are tired or drained from something. If this is the two of you arguing, yeah, they're just afraid of, do you still love them? Are you still mad at them? Okay, how do you feel about this person? And if you don't know this person, this will, Possibly how you do feel about them when meeting them or getting to know them. Nine of coins. So you see them as a good catch. How do they view you? Up in the air. So they don't know. Look at the tower. I knew it. I thought that was going to come out here, but it's under the deck. Kind of like, um, kind of like they, okay. If this is your energy, I don't know. Maybe you've kind of been like really erratic, up and down, hormonal or something possibly. Um, or if not, then that has nothing to do with you here. And they just don't know how you feel. They're afraid to be rejected is what I'm seeing here. Three of Cups flipped out just now. So I'm not sure if that's a date. Or if there's a third party. Wow, it's all the same energy. Okay, I'm going to put that Three of Cups back in. Could there be a third party and you found out and now you're pissed off? Yeah, absolutely. Nine of Coins, please. Hierophant, the death card, six of wands. So I'm going to take that. Okay, so I feel like some of you got out of a relationship, walked away. Um, now you're single or you're available, you're a great catch, but you're not approachable. So oh my gosh, this person dreams about you. Look at you're under the deck. Oh, they're looking at your picture, what's coming in. Uh, it could be an earth sign again. Wow, this person seems a bit timid. It seems like a Scorpio reading for some reason. I feel like there's definitely a Scorpio involved. It feels like it's your energy, though. But um, you may have Scorpio in your chart. So this person may work with you, and they want to talk to you. They want to reach out to you, and they dream about you, but they are 
obviously very nervous. Hmm, I don't know why though. What is the potential outcome? Work. Okay, so that means you're doing this, the status quo. You're, you're gonna run into them. I feel like this is someone you work with and you guys have been making eyes and you know that uh, they like you, you like them. They're, I mean, if this isn't dreaming about someone, I mean, look at his face. It's like daydreaming about you looking at your picture. Okay, so eight of coins work. So we have the nine of wands, the devil, the four of wands, the king of coins. Eight of wands, okay. I kind of felt like maybe you might work too much, possibly, but... Yeah, this might be an earth sign, specifically a Capricorn. I feel like this person comes across in a very different way than how they truly feel. They may come across a little bit on the arrogant side. Um, But they're going to reach out because this is wanting a new beginning with you four of wands i feel like this yeah, i definitely like this person isn't showing how they feel but the king of coin and the devil here i feel like they don't express it whatsoever what is the ace of wands for you now some of you might be with dealing with another person though it's kind of weird energy for an outcome to me if it doesn't feel quite right like it matches the reading what is the ace of wands looking at the past knight of cups there is arguing but the sun came out Okay, I don't know why this person is so fearful. So unless you guys have been fighting a lot, you know who this is, or um, you work together and it's just, you know, you guys are on different teams, you work opposite each other or something, um, you work a lot, you're cranky. I don't know if they're cranky, but I don't, I don't know, unless they're a boss. If they're your boss, coworker, they may be afraid to approach you. This could be easily someone you work with and they just don't know if it's a good idea. Should they uh, reach out, communicate, tell you how they feel? This right here tells me they may not because of this right here. Because it kind of, it feels like status quo. Like, okay, I'm just gonna work and, um, I mean, it could move forward with Eight of Wands, but this devil could also to me represent kind of like fear. Or you work too much. You may work from your home and you never go outside so this person can't see you also. Five of Coins, yeah. So careful of overworking also. Uh, careful of, not getting involved with, with activities with other people. This is a side note. This person really likes you. Okay, who is this person? I'm go, why are they so fearful? Why are they afraid to approach? Pay attention to the details. Okay. And they're hurt. Okay. Walking away. All right. For some of you, you must know who this is. You must know that this person is hurt. So maybe some of you have gotten angry, upset with this person, or you pushed him away in some way. Or they've been hurt by somebody else, or they see you as being hurt. Okay, they're paying. Maybe it's them that's paying attention to the details of you, and they see that you're hurt, and they don't want to just come, you know, barging in. They want to take their time. Um, they definitely like you. Okay. What else do we need to know about this situation? What else do we need to know about this situation? Along that deck. Okay, oh, Hierophant flipped around. Ten of Cups, Eight of Wands. So, yeah, this person thinks about being in a relationship with you. You might be married to them, but I didn't feel that, into, you know, strongly. Or they think about getting married to you or see, having a family together. What else? We have the King of Cups, which could be you or them and Chariot. So, they may come visit you. They might be a Cancer specifically. But, um, I mean, of course, that could be you, but I feel like it's them. I feel like they have very romantic feelings for you. What can we know about this King of Cups? Two of Swords, Guarding Their Heart, World, Ten of Coins. This feels like a relationship, like you guys have gotten out of something recently. It's kind of feeling like that. Some of you may have been, have gotten divorced within the last year or so. Um, or your kids have graduated and moved out or it's like I'm definitely like a new cycle is starting for you this might be a long lost love you guys also because got chariot under here now with the ace of coin and the six of wands I mean this is like a really big offer what is the chariot seven of wands temperance and the fool 
might be the month of July specifically. Um, this person might decide just to, to, you know, on a whim, come see you, come talk to you, visit you, send you a message. I feel like they're going to do it in person, though, with, with what I'm seeing, visitors showing up. Anything else we need to help this person who's drawn to you? Disconnect and relax. Don't worry about it. Also, I'm getting changes coming. Because obviously you have the Nine of Cups here. So this is making you happy. This is a wish fulfilled from this person. Um, they may bring some type of order to your life. So, you know, if your life feels kind of chaotic, possibly with the sun. You might even marry this person or have kids or buy a home with this person. Also with the Ten of Cups, you know, hair font. Sorry for the glare. I moved everything. All right. Anything else? One, more, one last card, please. Oh, and I'll pull a... Yeah, they're going to take a risk. Yeah, they're holding on. They've been holding on, I think, for a while, how they feel about you. So take it as it resonates. I feel like this could be a diff different person for a lot of you. Some of you work with them. Some of you, this could be a long lost love. Some of you, this you know this person. You know, you guys argue like brother. Well, I don't say that. Like um, best friends, but you know they really have strong feelings for you. What can we know about this person, good or bad? Because everyone has flaws. They're oh, they're responsible. Thank God. Okay. They might have family problems, or you might. That's under the deck, so I'm not too worried about it. But this person is responsible. That might be we have so many eight of coins. Maybe they work a lot. Maybe they're the king of coins. They're rebuilding. Uh, they're, maybe they uh, are workaholic with the devil and eight of coins. Sometimes that comes up, chained to their desk. Okay. I think I'm going to leave it there. It's, I feel like this is coming in definitely the month of July. I feel like it's very close. Maybe August for some of you or September, July, August. I hate pushing it out that month much, but um, I feel like it's mainly July. All right, so I'm going to leave it there, you guys. Have a really good week, and I'll talk to you soon.